as we are excited now to welcome in their head coach, Felicia Legette. Jack, coach, we appreciate the time. Looks like you're on the bus with your crew, maybe, getting making your way back to go on the road, get this win, get the season sweep, two things that have never been done. What does that do for your program? You know what? You got to be the glory. You know, this young team is coming together, you know, very quickly. And they, you know, I got to be careful what I say to them because whatever I say, they, they, they're locked in and they're loaded. And uh, I, I'm just so proud of their effort and their discipline uh, to, to go into Notre Dame and beat Notre Dame. I mean, obviously, it's something that we've not, not done before. 19 times that we came back with the L. Uh, this time, it was a little bit different. Uh, the age of fear is a special young lady. We get behind her, good things can happen. Yeah, Coach, you've built a terrific culture, and now you're starting to see it come to fruition with that big win on the road against a ranked team. This team is really up and coming. What do you think the future holds for you? You know what? Right now, we're just locked into now, Coach. We're just really just trying to say, let's just be where our feet are, and at the end of the season, we'll look back and say, this is how far we've come. But right now, we're just so young, we're just kind of enjoying this moment. We're not looking ahead of us because ahead of us is Virginia Tech. And so we're just kind of locked in and, and taking in the moment and, and just playing for something bigger than ourselves. And that, that's our, our faith, our family, and uh, each other. Yeah, Coach, you uh, mentioned one of the great point guards right now in the ACC and DHA Fair. What is it like coaching a player of that caliber? Uh, I tell you one thing, I, I just ask her what she needs. You need a screen? You need to be left alone? You need, you need a pedicure? I mean, whatever you need. I just need you to know that I'm here for you. But, you know, I'm a post coach, and for some reason I've been blessed with guards that can play the game. Because one reason behind I got some great assistant coaches that really are doing a tremendous job of working with them. And I just stay out of their way. And the age is that kid that, you know, she just trusts me. And I trust her. And when you trust somebody like a DA's of fear, she honor it by giving you her best effort. And I'm just so humbled by how this young lady just kind of believes in me and, and believes in what we're trying to build here and, and shows her game the way she does. Hey, that's Lena, Lena Rice. <laughs> Coach, we know that the bus ride's going to be a happy one, that's for sure, and we know how great DeAsia Fair is. Tonight, I thought some of your depth really showed up with Wooly, Elena Rice, who just walked behind you. Who got the hard hat tonight, Coach? Elena. Elena Rice got the hard hat. because she, she went downhill from the jump ball. She just said, you know what? Get behind me because I'm coming. Mm -hmm. Not to say it was going to be pretty. I to say that it was going to go in. But she showed no fear, and that gave us confidence to follow her lead. She got stripped in open court, and she just laughed. And that just meant, that was monumental for us because we, our kids can get really like down and things like that happen. But Elena just made us believe that she got us, and so we just joined her, uh, joined her wings and flew with her. Coach, you said you were a post coach, and I thought you won the game on the backboard. Your young post players really coming along to help this team. Well, you know, we were called soft one time in this season, and I uh, said that we wouldn't play with a lot of heart, and that we took that personal. And we, we went to work on the, on the rebounding part of the ball, and that's the strength of mine. And I just say, you know what? I don't care how you come down with it, come down with it. If you got them with you, come down with it. But that's how I played, and, and that's something they kind of gravitate towards, and, and they're, they're starting to understand that assignment. I just love the way Kyra Wood is leading our way, and, and she's tracking that rebound very well, and she's becoming slippery uh, as she flies in there. And um, the, the young is starting to get better, too, and um, uh, this kid named Alyssa Latham. So, and the strongest one of them all is the shortest one of them all, and that's Sen Sanaya Wilson. Out rebounding of 50 to 34 tonight, Coach. Real quick before we let you go, I'm enjoying seeing all the faces of the girls as they walk by, and they're like, oh, gosh, she's doing a thing right now. we are got to be quiet. Who do we not want to sit by on the bus? Is there somebody as a coach that you're like, okay, she's crazy. She's got to be in the corner afterwards. She's too wild. Uh, Elena. <laughs> and she sat next to me at every meal this, this time. I'm like, why you keep sitting next to me? Like, you and I, we're like all in water. But I tell you thing, this young lady has come such a, a long way from last year to their fifth coach she had had. And why should I continue to believe in, in coaches as they always leave? And she stayed. And she could have went overseas and played. And she's decided to just trust one more coach. And it's such a joy to see her just flower out and to become this amazing human being and 
I'm just really, really lucky to have this young lady on our team. The hard hot winner tonight, she had 19, 8, and 2 assists. Coach, congratulations on the win. Safe travels to you guys, and I'm sure we'll be talking to Thank you again you so soon. Much.